Finish eating out of your overcooked bento box, pick up your Stardew Valley Joja Cola glass from off of a Rocket League coaster, and place that glass in the cup holder that's a part of your $14,000 gaming throne. Complete with up to three monitor mounts, RGB lighting, and a massage gaming chair because why not? And also because I'm Jake and this is the return of Game Night. If you don't happen to have $14,000 sitting in your Cyberpunk 2077 wallet, it might be because you're forever in debt to Tom Nook, Candle. If he comes to your house looking for bells, tell him, You shall not pass! Doormat. If that doesn't work, just turn off your lights using your arcade light switch and hide in a Metal Gear Solid box, Pin. It's a little too dark in here. Mind if I turn on this Spider-Man lamppost lamp? Or would you prefer the piranha plant lamp? Just don't get them too close together because carnivorous plants eat spiders and other bug snacks. Pin set. See what I did there? Do you see yourself in this Assassin's Creed Valhalla Viking style hoodie? Because I do and you, mm, you look great. You know what else looks great? A Wario mech suit figure, which will pair nicely with a 43 inch tall Doom Slayer statue that comes with a crucible sword, super shotgun, plasma rifle, BFG, heavy cannon, and chainsaw. All yours for the low price of, oh, well, maybe, maybe someone will leave it under your Christmas tree covered in Xbox ornaments or PlayStation ornaments, depending on your personal console preference. My personal preference? Thanks for asking. It's an arcade game typography book. It explores 250 pixel typefaces from classic arcade games like X-Men, Space Invaders, Ladybug, Fantasy Zone, and more. But let's mark our place with a Final Fantasy save game bookmark and check out my other favorite console, the Pin Switch, which turns your Switch into a small pinball machine. Oh, you want a smaller console? Oh, okay. I'll give you smaller. Like the world's smallest foldable handheld console, the Fun Key S. It is tiny, but allows you to play games from the NES, Super NES, PlayStation 1, Sega Game Gear, Genesis, and many, many more. It even fits on a keychain. So scoot over that Shovel Knight bottle opener one you have to make some room. Moving on. Oh, uh, uh, I'm not sure which Among Us plush it was, but orange. You look sus. Vinyl decal. And speaking of vinyl, if you're a longtime Vsauce viewer, you've probably heard this song. This song, Moon Men by Jake Chudnow, and two other songs that have never been released and never been heard by anyone, are now available for the first time ever on a limited edition vinyl record. Specifically, this vinyl record. Each track has been beautifully remastered, put onto a translucent record, and placed in an incredibly designed sleeve by Geoglyzer. Only 500 copies exist. There will never be more made, and most importantly, 100% of the profit from these records goes to Alzheimer's research. So go pre-order yours now before it's gone forever. It'll start shipping worldwide in January 2021. Now I wanna briefly tell you why I brought Game Loot back and why that awesome vinyl record exists. So a few months ago, a gentleman named Dylan reached out to me and he told me a story. He said that six years ago, I had featured him in Game Loot number 25, where I shared his Etsy store, Pixel Empire. And from that shout out, he was actually able to create a legitimate Pixel Empire. And I had no idea that my video, and by extension you, had, had done this for him. He was able to, to realize his dream and, and live his passion. So in talking to me, we decided we wanted to do something to, to give back to others because we've been very fortunate, and that's why this limited edition vinyl exists. It's about celebrating the music that we use with Jake Chudnow, allowing you to have a piece of that history, and also to, to help support Alzheimer's research, which is so incredibly important. But back to Pixel Empire. The reason I mentioned them in the first place six years ago was because of the incredible art they made. And now they work with over a hundred artists creating posters like these. some of my personal favorites from Felix Tyndall. You can even keep yourself and others safe while looking stylish in these face masks. As a thank you, Dylan has given every Vsauce viewer a 15% discount on his site using code Vsauce. Links to all the loot can be found in the description below. And at the top of the description, you'll find the link to the Vsauce Times Chudnow vinyl with all profits going to Alzheimer's research. Very, very excited about that. And as always, thanks for watching. <laughs>